We're looking down the street at where the U.S. Grant Hotel is. Now, you might notice there's like a guy by some signs right over there. That's like around the entrance to the U.S. Grant. Now, U.S. Grant is named after our president, Ulysses S. Grant, and it was built by his son. Now, I'm going to call him U.S. Grant Jr. for the time being because I don't know his name. Anyway, you can tell there's a cutout like right here. See, if you look, the street's a lot thinner until about right there where that bus is going. Now, U.S. Grant Jr., he built his hotel on Broadway and he wanted to make sure that you could get off your car or horse or, I don't know, dog sled, whatever, and you'd look down and you'd see the water right down there. Now, you have to remember, this was back in the day where we didn't have big buildings like that or like even the ones that are super tall, which, oh, like that one there. There's a story about the airport, which explains why our buildings are still short. I mean, that was a really big building from back in the day in San Diego until like the 80s. The only place that was really tall was the El Cortez Hotel, which is farther east than here. But he wanted to have that view shed so that people getting off of their whatevers could see that water. And everyone would be like, oh, the U.S. Grand Hotel is so awesome. Oh. Anyway, this is Broadway. And if you know San Diego, you know our streets go, um, let's see, Cedar, Beach, Ash, A, B, C, Broadway, E, F, G, and they keep going. They keep going. Now, you may ask yourself, self, why is this? And you'll find out if you watch Ken Kramer's About San Diego, which I have watched a lot of, because, you know, KPBS, woo! And I'm bored, apparently, during that time in my life. Um, what happened was there was a mayor or something who didn't want to live on D Street, so he changed its name to Broadway, and now we have Broadway. On this side. 